Over the weekend, the NAU men's basketball team in the, played in the semifinal game of the Big Sky tournament with a bid to the Big Dance on the line for the winner of the Big Sky. The Jacks beat Northern Colorado in their first round earlier in the week before a matchup with the host school at the University of Montana. This was a tightly contested game that was tied up at 59 in the closing seconds as the Grizz drove the court for a layup with just 0.4 seconds left on the clock. And this is where things get sticky as an ineligible player from the Grizzly bench ran onto the court with time still left on the clock, which usually results in an automatic technical foul. But that call didn't come, forcing NAU to try for a last second full court heave, which you see right here. But that was unsuccessful. Coach Jack Murphy pointed fingers after the game, saying Montana got lucky, and this is where things get a little out of hand. Murphy's actions after the game resulted in a one game suspension. Now Murphy has since to said, since he since said he takes responsibility for his role in the postgame incident, the Jacks would fall 61 to 59. Chris Yonku scored 26 points and dished out four assists, while Quentin Upshur added 17 points as well. The Jacks season is not over, though, as they were invited to the to compete in the CollegeInsider.com postseason tournament, where they will face Grand Canyon University. The Jacks will play Wednesday night at GCU Arena at six. And staying in the world of sports, NAU high jumper Deontay Kemper finished his indoor track and field season with a fourth place finish. Over overall at the NCAA National Championships over the weekend. The, season, the senior athlete also earned an All-American honors for the first time in his career. Kemper will join the rest of his team as they kick off the outdoor season next weekend at UC Irvine.